great morning it is sunday so what do the cards have to say today okay <clears throat> first we have ready but waiting okay we have to be ready to move but sometimes it takes you know this is not exactly the time for it yet okay so we have to be ready get prepared but again here's the andean cross which says it's not the time at present time okay once things come around and the the Mueller investigation is done and we can get moved to start getting Trump out then we move get ready to move in mass in force we have to go all all go vote do our voting what we need to do although really you know i i, I wish i could say there's going to be a great blue wave i really hope i'm wrong in this but i see with so much of the um <clears throat> so much of what they are doing to uh, skew suppress voter there, there really a lot is being done to counter our votes. So at this point, I cannot say there's a big blue wave. I pray that I am wrong and that it is a massive tidal wave. But I think it's going to be a lot closer than people are uh, say, saying it is at this present time. If I am wrong, I am going to be the happiest person on the planet to be wrong and see a huge blue tidal wave. Please let that be. But <clears throat> for now, it's saying, you know, again, that this is not the time. Um, and maybe it's time to deflect some of the drama that's coming. We need to deflect that. Don't take it in. Also... You need to take a leap of faith that things are going to work out, okay? Uh, the timing is not ours, always ours, okay? It's not always our timing when the ego wants. The ego wants it, and it wants it this second. Well, it doesn't work that way, okay? We have to work with the, with the energy of the planet, with the energy of everything, and it takes time for these things to move, okay? But also it's the time for stillness, okay? What is always, always, always that uh, admonition, which is be still and know, be still and know. If you want to find God, you have to be still. It's not rant and rave with the ego and you're going to find God. That It doesn't work that way. It comes through stillness, stilling within, calming the ego, going beyond the ego drama of its wants, its ills, its projections, its grabbing, its, because that covers it over. The only way you get to great spirit, to get to see the face of God, to get to know what's at the center of the universe is to be still doesn't mean you don't act in the world it means be still in your consciousness be still in your mind be still in your heart and then you can start breaking through these barriers of projections okay so be still and know Take that leap of faith that things are going to work out if we all continue to work together. Okay, If we hold the line, if we don't give in to the fear and the madness and the drama, deflect the fear and the drama and the madness. Deflect that. Don't take it in. Don't honor it. Don't give it space in your lives. Okay? Understand this is not the most opportune time to act, except for to get out and vote, do what we can do to vote. We need to do that, okay? And be ready, but waiting, okay? 
When we see our opportunity, then we move. Continue to prepare for it. Continue to do what we can to get people in office that will write things. You know, maybe it's going to take getting Trump out of office and getting these Republicans that are on the payroll of ones like, uh, like the Mercers, like the Koch brothers that are in bed with, with Russia. They're in bed with whoever they can get the money from and get the, you know, that, that's the way it is right now. And if we want things to change, then we need to change it from grassroots up. We need to, again, change the voting system. There needs to be a massive change in this country. And this is a huge, huge, huge wake up call for us. So see this as a wake up call. Okay, and what's going on is transient and we can change it. I've got to go, got a call. See you online. Aho.